Musical Futures is a Paul Hamlin special initiative that began in 2003. Its purpose is to implement and introduce informal learning in a typically formal classroom setting to sustain interest in and provide engaging musical activities throughout schools in the UK. Their instrumentation usually involves pop instruments such as guitars, drums, voice, piano, and bass, but can be applied to any type. They also provide little to no funding to actual music programs as their aim is to provide informal approaches to music teaching more than anything. Musical Futures, though, has extended across the world and is being applied in all types of musical settings such as Brazilian rumba. Therefore, Musical Futures can be defined as a movement and outgrowth of informal learning. Oral learning is at the focus of the approach. Students must have access to the recording at all times and watch and listen regularly through the process. Teachers, music leaders, and experienced students take on the role of coach. They model and demonstrate instrumental parts. Guidance sheets and written material are designed for teachers. They can be used upon the student's request, but they should not be given as a starting point. Though Music Futures curricula is designed for use with pop instruments, Music Futures curricula can be used within any musical class setting, including but not limited to band, orchestra, or choral. Vocalists can split up into small groups and learn the specified song, as well as come up with their own arrangements. For band and orchestral instrumentations, the students can use the same techniques of oral learning that pop instruments would use, but using film scoring rather than pop music would be ideal, as film scores provide the larger instrumentation required and the fun recognizability that pop music has, yet it also contains much of the intellectual aspect of classical music. Film scores prove to be very effective in that a student can correlate the association between an image and the music. With pop sounds, you cannot achieve this. With the film score music, the student will be able to see and discuss how a particular piece of music can accompany a certain situation such as happy music for a celebration or scary music for a hard scene. With the complex instrumentation that film scoring presents, Musical Future is a great way to apply informal learning to the teaching of the song while still preserving the intellectualism of the song. Informal learning is learning that does not occur through conventional means or methods and can be defined as anything that happens outside the classroom or what a student does on his own. It is more hands-off than hands-on as far as the teacher's perspective goes. For example, a student learning the finger placements on a guitar by watching a YouTube video in formal learning, rather than taking a class that breaks down to move the fingers and where they go, which would be formal learning. The piece that we are doing a lesson plan to is Through Heaven's Eyes from the film The Prince of Egypt. Single thread of tapestry, those color brightly shine. Can never see its purpose in the pattern of the grand design. And the stone that sits on the very top of the mountain's mighty face doesn't it think it's more important than the stones that form the base. So, how can you see what your life is worth or where your value lies? You can never see through the eyes of man. You must look at your life.
what he builds or buys. You can never see with your eyes or not. Look through heaven's eyes. Look at your life. Look at your life. Look at your life through heaven's eyes. This is a sample lesson plan on how musical features would work with our teaching. At first, we will divide the groups into five, each having varying instrumentation, such as voice percussion and the melody. Then we will pass out the chord sheets, uh, which are color-coded to the specific groups. Then everybody will perform. Then give each group 20 minutes to learn their parts. Just have them separated around the room and after 10 minutes go around to see if the students need the teacher's help uh, and where the teachers really there for facilitation instead of actually teaching um, we would only help the group if the group needs the help then each group will perform their section of the music then after each group has performed, ask for their feedback, such as the tone quality, where the dynamics were, the tempo, the conducting signs, uh, things like that. Then together, once more, the whole classroom will perform. Through Heaven's Eyes was just an example of the many things that Music Futures curriculum can do. In fact, we've chosen three other songs from famous film films that you might know, both animated and real, which are included within our policy brief. This is our proposal that this curriculum be adopted by the Miami-Dade County School Department as well as first within our school, Everglades, and then throughout several schools in the area until finally perhaps all of South Florida. We believe that this curriculum allows students to engage and connect with music with a greater intimacy than they ever have before within American education. And we hope you accept our proposal and adopt this new curriculum. Thank you for watching. Look at your